Okay, um, back with another one. These vlogs kind of get uh, addicting. Gotta be honest with you, didn't really expect that. But a lot of thoughts. Usually I'd write that shit down, but the problem with writing is you have to take like five seconds, you know, to write it down. But this is like, fuck me, I don't have this time. So, basically, what, uh, what bothers me is like uh, trash bins. There are really no trash bins at all. And this is quite frankly pretty disgusting. Come to think of it like, uh, you know, uh, Ingolstadt is back, uh, back home. Ingolstadt is my hometown. And like, there are trash bins everywhere, you know. And uh, Munich is like a big world city. I think everybody knows about Munich. And here are like uh, four or five trash bins in Munich and the whole area. I don't know what's up with that. I mean, yeah, there's the casual, like, uh, I don't know if I can show you this. Like, here you can see some trash bins, like on these uh, bus stops. But other than that, you're kind of screwed. You know, like, uh, they expect you to collect this trash. And this is kind of fucked up. And what happens when people should collect trash? They don't collect trash. They take the trash and throw it onto the street. And then you have like these big piles of garbage and uh, nobody cares. And the solution to that is uh, just ignoring the problem. Like in a lot of cases, ignoring problems is always the best solution, you know? And that's why a lot of trash piles up over these months and years. And uh, yeah, this was my first thing. The second thing is like, uh, there was this fat, disgusting old woman and like she had she was like a serious uh, traffic problem and uh, there was like a short, a small traffic jam and she had to glide her fat ass through this traffic jam. Later on, I was buying some water. Uh, I'll get to that very soon. Uh, I was buying some water and uh, she was running very closely. I mean like one fucking centimeter away, away from my face. And the centimeter, sorry for the wrong pronunciation. Pronunciation is very important. And uh, yeah, that was happening. And uh, whew, after that, what was happening after that? What the fuck was I thinking? Yeah, where I live right now, the boomer is telling me, yeah, I need to buy like, you know, water and bottles. This is so fucking retarded. The water there is drinkable. Yeah, nah. Uh, it's not drinkable a little bit maybe but otherwise you get like sick and uh, bullshit I call bullshit like always all people make a, a lot of shit like homeopathic products and shit like that yeah I feel how it's working y'all do your voodoo magic y'all and uh, no total bullshit man you got you got ripped off and you enjoy paying for the shitty product which is only working inside of your brain neurons collecting connecting and collecting you know this is what's working nothing more and then there's this effect yeah wanted to say like usually I'm a big fan of uh, one shot you know one shots and uh, doing everything right at the moment you know being in this kind of a momentum of uh, improvisation and what could go wrong or right and uh, there's the big argument with scripts you have like more elaborate ideas and videos to come up and yeah that's why I'm uh, kind of sticking in some kind of uh, I'd say middle middle ground thingy because I'm not 100% improv but I'm also not 100% script so what is the solid media medium between these two lines it's basically making simple notes with simple words this is helping quite a lot yeah that's always all that I wanted to say.